What is up guys? Welcome to the studio. I'm John the Potter. So great to have you in the studio. Today's video is going to kind of be an update video. We have a kiln to unload. That's going to be the last pieces in the restock that's happening uh, this Sunday, June 13th at 6 p.m. Uh, so I want a couple things I want to talk about with you guys first. First of all, the Etsy sales for this summer are June 13th, July 11th, and August 18th. This is what is in the first restock, right here. It's our biggest restock yet. We have over 200 pieces. Uh, there are some amazing pieces in here. I just want to show you a couple. So a few of my piece, favorite pieces that are going up in this restock. This has actually slip designed in here and then it's slow cooled. A bunch, we have maybe like eight or nine Insanity mugs. I'm able to get eight to 10 of these done a month. Uh, and they're just turn out super cool with the micro crystals in there. These carved ones have been really popular. Love those. What else do we got? This new combo. How cool is that? I love this midnight rain over. I mean, I love like, I mean, I make it because I love it. Like I continue to uh, like do the glazes that I love and make the pots that I love. But anyway, there's just a lot of really unique stuff in this uh, batch and would love for you guys to check it out. The second thing I want to talk to you guys about is for the first time ever, I'm inviting you to my studio for an epic pottery event. So August 14th and 15th, you're invited to my studio. I'm gonna have a ton of pots for sale. My goal, my commitment is over 500 pieces for sale. Mugs, bowls, plates, vases, flower planters, anything you can think of, I'm gonna try and have it ready for that August epic pottery event. Throughout the day, we're gonna do raku demonstrations where we pull pots out of the raku. You can see how that's done. I'm gonna have my wheel set up, so I'll do throwing. And the thing I'm most excited about is I'm gonna have 100 bisqued pots, right? So I'll have 100 pots like this that are not glazed yet. And then you can buy one and choose the glaze combination. So it's gonna be $50 and that includes shipping. You will have the choice of all the different combinations. I'm gonna tell you about that project that we're working on right now uh, in a second about all the test tiles. But then you pick the combination you want, you can glaze it. I'll have all the glazes out if you want, like I can kind of coach you how to glaze it. Or you could have me glaze it if you don't wanna don't want mess it up. But then we'll glaze the combo you want and then stick it in the mail, ship it to you so it's like a pot that you actually chose the glaze. That's gonna be a really cool event. Um, I'm gonna try and figure out some way to like have a pre-sale on that so you can buy it before you come here so you can reserve your mug spot or whatever. Anyway, that leads me to my next thing which is this giant glaze testing combination project that we're working on. So we have made over 700 test tiles to glaze the combinations of 26 different glazes, every single combination, right? So on this chart, we have 26 glazes on this side, 26 glazes up here, and then every single one is numbered of this is the base layer and then that's the top layer. So for example, this is 179, test tile number 179. So I go find 179, and that would be bright blue gloss over muddy waters. So then when this gets fired, we'll be able to see what combo that is. So we'll have 676 different test tiles with different glaze combinations uh, that you can choose from for that mug for that event. So that's kind of, I mean, the goal is to like be able to find new combos for us, uh, for me to use, but it's also for this epic pottery event to have you guys actually be able to choose the glazes based on like what colors, what combinations you like. So that's very, very exciting. There's gonna be videos coming on very soon about that. We actually have our first batch of test tiles done in the kiln that we're unloading right now. So these are all 676 glazed test tiles that we'll get in the next glaze kiln. There's more, and then there's a few in the kiln too. Box is prepped for the restock. Okay, so we are unloading the little tester kiln, which we fired yesterday. And it has a bunch of the marbled pieces in it that I threw, I made a video about that like last week, go check it out. So you can see all these pots, how they were thrown in that last video I did. Here is, this one's ready to be fired. So once we unload this one, then I'll fire this one once I'm ready to be done in the studio because I don't need it any more hotter in here, any hotter in here. But here, let's check it out. The first batch of test tiles. God, I see some in here that I, that must be Aurora Green or something. Ooh, that's kind of cool. 
Must be raspberry mist, but I'll have to check the number. So all the textiles are made with an extruder, and so one side has the smooth on it, and then one side has a texture on it, so you can see what the glaze does over a texture. So we each we glaze them all so the line was right about there. So you can see some don't run at all, right? Because they don't have any flux in them or they're they're just less runny of a glaze. And some will melt together like perfectly. So you know that when you do this combo, you know, it's gonna drip. Whereas if you do this combo, it won't drip. So you can be more aggressive glazing one a combo like this versus this. And then I don't always put witness cones in my kilns anymore, but I did put one in this one just because I haven't run the test kiln all that often. So that's a cone seven. So that's pretty good for the cone seven, right down to the bottom. Ooh, look at those mugs back there. That looks awesome. More test tiles. So yeah, we did we did quite a few of the gloss glazes because I would love to find some some combos with that, but the gloss glazes just don't run at all. Like even when you put runny glazes on top, they just don't run. There's like the black gloss that must be. That's pretty sweet. Like, yeah, I mean, that's what we're hoping for is one out of like, one out of 50. If you can get one out of 50 out, then we'll have 12 new great combos. Cause it's 600 whatever. So we'll have 13 new great glaze combos if one out of 50 is really good. So that must be the, the glossy white. Oh. Okay, now we get to the fun stuff. So this was the marbled with raspberry mist on the inside. That's really nice. Really cool. Look at that. Look at that little design in there. Sweet! Oh, can you just tell I'm so hot? It's 100 degrees in this kiln right now. It's over 90 degrees in this room. Yes, beautiful. So these will be up on the restock. We're gonna, we got everything prepped and ready for the restock except for what's in this kiln. So, gotta do that. Here we go. Those are very cool. Look at that. Nice big old drip. Look how look how the drip comes down, but you can see the marble through the glaze. That's really cool. I like that a lot. Oh my gosh. Well, that one just beep, popped off the bottom. That doesn't happen very often. There's the bottom. Pop. Oh, wow. So here's the marbled with blue surf on the inside and a clear glaze on the outside so like sometimes I'll leave it without a glaze and I like that that a lot but that clear glaze is super nice Wow I like it the inside is gorgeous too so these two I did not clear glaze the outside and that's where you get the drippiness the look Wow so this is midnight rain or blue surf over alabaster the inside there's like these cool micro crystals in here if you can see that so the reason we're using this little kiln was just because I did want to get these done before the that big old drip, before the restock. Gorgeous! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Beautiful, beautiful. Love that. Nice. Love it. So in here, there's black color clay, there's blue color clay, there's turquoise color clay, and there's gray. Maybe that's the gray. Nice. The bottoms are always super cool too. Beautiful. Those all turned out super well. I'm very happy. Check it out. So these are all the test tiles that came out. We're not going to count the test tiles as pots that we got done. 15 pots. 15 pots. All right. So remember, if you want to check out any of these pots, June 13th, Etsy. And if you're planning your summer road trips, make an effort to come out to uh, Waconia, Minnesota. Check out my studio. We just got a new driveway installed so that you'll have somewhere to park. And it's gonna be awesome. You can come out, glaze your own pot, you know, do all the other stuff. Come check out Mocha Monkey. Anyway, we'd love to see you. It's very exciting. I hope to make it an annual event and do it every year. Uh, it's gonna be awesome. All right, if you haven't already, please hit subscribe, like the video, share it, all those things. And we'll see you guys in the next video.
Understand that we get one chance, one chance, you.